you big viewers, you are welcome to Master T Academy's channel. In this class this morning, we want to look at a question on what problem leading to equation. This kind of question can be simply solved by interpreting the statement correctly. We want to listen to this video to the end so as to understand and be able to solve this kind of question. Now, when we solve it, we have solution. Sonny is twice as old as Wally. That is statement. One year ago, he was four times as old as Wally. Another statement. When will the son of the age be 66? Be 66. So, you take it statement by statement we interpret it. So for the first statement, Sonny is twice as old as Wally. In mathematics, we can represent Sonny with the letter and Wally with the letter. And I want to use the first letter, the first letter of the animal. now. So for Sonny, we let Sonny be X, and for Wally, we let that one be W. So Sonny X is twice as old as Wally means is two times. The age of Wally, so that's only equal to 2 W. That's the statement here. Yeah. The second statement, four years ago, he was four times as old as Wally. Four years ago, we need to get the age of Sonny four years ago. Now, four years ago, Sonny's age will be S minus 4. So we subtract S, we subtract 4 from his present age now. So his present age now is S, then minus 4. That means first years ago, Sonny is S minus 4 years. And 4 years ago, he was 4 times. 4 times. That's 4 times the age of 1 in 4 years ago. 1 in 2 4 years ago was W minus 4. So that's the second statement. 4 years ago, Sonny was 4 times the age of 1 in 4 years ago. So we have these two equations now. We can solve it by substituting the value of x here into equation 2. So since x is 2w, I can write this one as 2w. That's 2w minus 4 equals to, open this bracket here, you have 4w minus 16. So by the time we collect the last thing and we solve, bring plus 4 to this side. To make 2w, that's 2w minus, plus 4 will become minus 4, that's 4w minus 4w equals to, then minus 16 is left here, you have minus 16, then take minus 4 to that side, become plus 4. So by the time we solve this now, we have on this side 2w minus 4w, that's minus 2w, then equals to, Minus 16 plus 4, that's minus 12. The Bible side are minus 2, so as to get W. That means W will be equal to minus 12 over minus 2, and that is plus 6. So that means one present age now is 6 years. So one is 6 years old now. Then we cannot get our sunny age by substituting F W equals to 6. In the first equation here, so that means s equals to 2 times w, that's 2 times 6, and that is equal to 12. So Sonny is 12 years old currently now. So we are done with this statement here now. The last statement when will the son of their ages be 66? When? That's the future thing now. So we don't know the year. In mathematics, you can use a letter. You can use a letter. You can say, let a letter represent. In this now, I want to use a letter A now. Let A be the year that the sum of their ages will be 66. Let A be the year. So that means, in A year time now, Sonny will now be 12 plus A. In A year time, Sonny will be 12 plus A. Because it's a future thing, we need to add it. So Sonny will be 12 plus 8. Then Wale 2 will be 6 plus 8. Then the sum of their ages in the year time will be 12 plus 8 plus 
6 plus 8. So we add the 8 together in ages time and the sum will give us what? This is 6. Now we want to find the value of 8. Eh? So when we add it together, collect the like terms, add it together. 12 plus 6 will give us 18. Then 8 plus 8 will give us 2a. Then equal to 66. So by the time we collect the like terms, that means 2a will be equal to 66 minus 18. Then that 2a equal to 48. Divide both sides by 2 now to get the value of 8. That means a equals to 48 over 2, and that is 24. So therefore, in 24 years' time, the sum of their ages will be 66. So in 24 years' time, subscribe to this channel and turn on your notification for our next video. Thanks.